In this video, I will compare the Intel Core Ultra 9185H and Intel Core i9-14900HX highlighting their differences, and then provide a conclusion to help you determine which one is the better choice. This Intel i9-14900HX was released on January 9, 2024 which is around one month after the release of Intel Core Ultra 185H. This Core Ultra 9185H has 6 performance core and 12 efficiency core whereas that of Core i9-14900HX has 8 performance core and 16 efficiency core. Also this Core Ultra has 10 performance threads and 10 efficiency threads whereas that of Core i9-14900HX has 16 performance threads and 16 efficiency threads. The base and boost frequencies of the Intel Ultra 9 are higher than those of the Intel i9-14900HX. This could benefit single-core performance tasks as well as multi-core performance. However, due to the higher number of performance cores and threads, the overall raw performance of the Intel i9-14900HX is better than that of the Intel Core Ultra 9185H. This Intel Core Ultra 9 has a high L1 cache, allowing it to store more frequently used data and instructions directly for the cores. The L2 cache of both processors is the same, however, the L3 cache of the Intel i9 is larger, enabling it to hold more data that multiple cores might need, thereby reducing the frequency of accessing slower system RAM. The Intel i9 can support up to 192GB of memory, whereas the Intel Core Ultra supports only up to 96GB. The Intel Core Ultra 9 CPU, with support for LPDDR5 and DDR5 memory, is significantly better than the Intel i9-14900HX CPU, which supports only DDR5 and old DDR4. The Intel Core Ultra supports ARC graphics with 8-core integrated graphics, which is better than the UHD graphics of the Intel i9. Additionally, the boost clock frequency of ARC graphics 8 is higher. The Intel i9-14900HX supports ECC, making it suitable for critical systems like servers and workstations, whereas the Intel Core Ultra 9 does not support ECC. Both processors support PCIe version 5, with the Intel Core Ultra 9 having more PCIe lanes. Additionally, the Intel Core Ultra 9185H can withstand higher temperatures when the CPU is under load. The TDP of both processors is configurable. The 35 to 65 watt range of the Ultra 9 offers greater versatility, providing a wider spectrum of power efficiency and performance with slightly better power efficiency. The 45 to 55 watt range of the Intel i9 leans towards prioritizing sustained performance with a higher baseline power draw. When looking at benchmark comparisons, the Intel i9-14900HX performs better in Cinebench R23 and Geekbench V6, as well as overall compared to the Core i9-14900HX. So we can conclude like this. Intel Core Ultra 9185H offers a better balance of power efficiency, improved integrated graphics, and AI capabilities, making it suitable for premium, thinner portable laptops. The Intel Core i9-14900HX delivers significantly higher raw CPU performance, making it ideal for high-end gaming laptops and mobile workstations, heavy video editing where maximum processing power is crucial. So my recommendations would be like for pure performance, go with 14900HX. For a more balanced approach with AI capabilities, choose Ultra 9185H.